I've spent the majority of my career lighting and filming interviews, of which I shoot around 300 each year, mostly indoors. This video is about backgrounds for interviews, so I won't be talking about lighting people. But let's take it as red. I lit our subject with the new Daedalight Lightstream Light Kit, which, as the name implies, is the smaller lightweight version of the much bigger Lightstream system used in motion picture and television. Put simply, Lightstream is a single parallel beam light source sent to multiple reflectors to create new light sources. This multi-light for the price of one approach greatly reduces my carbon footprint. Arriving at the location, I'm often presented with a less than ideal place to film in. At times it can be challenging to come up with a good looking background for the interview. The first thing I have to decide is, can I use the actual room background? If yes, then sometimes I'll blur the background a little more than usual to help distract from any items that can't be moved. Other possibilities include using barn doors to create a classic light slice across a background. A bit old school now, but still used. A gobo pattern in a data imaging projector can add texture, which helps break up the real background. The effect is best defocused. When the original location background is inappropriate, an effective solution can be a collapsible pop-up background. They are held up by a single stand and typically around 2 meters by 1.5, which is normally big enough for a talking head interview. Bigger backgrounds often use frame systems with stretched fabric. This is my 4 meter panoramic background with angled sides. It's self-supporting and big enough for multi-camera shoots with more than one person. Fabric backgrounds come in a wide range of colors and textures. My preference is mottled surfaces with grain black tones. Being neutral in color allows me to light and color them as I please. Here, I'm using small Luxio P200 RGBs. They're on the floor pointing upwards to create a simple graduated background. Daedalite has also moved into the world of full color with the birth of their new Daedalite Neo Color system. These new fixtures have all the greatness and precision of previous data lights, plus an extremely wide colour space which can produce subtle pastel shades to very strong vivid colours. It's Dado's most sophisticated light. With forward planning, you could create custom 35mm slides to project images or logos onto your background. I'm using a Dado DLED 7 with imaging projector which is perfect for this task, as it has little forward heat, preventing damage to the slides. Using Dado FX glass in an imaging projector can transform a flat background into something special. Each pattern is available in eight highly saturated dichroic colors. Eflect is one of Dado Light's newest tools. Just focus a light onto it, then bend and shape the multi-mirror reflector to create a multitude of effects. Adding an EFLECT colour filter to the Daedalight expands creativity even further. I see EFLECT as the textural equivalent of diffusion. These examples have been a few ways I create interesting backgrounds when filming interviews. I hope you found it useful. A carefully thought out background can add so much more personality to interviews. Mm -hmm.